back to another episode of Visa's Cooking Show. So today, we are making another dish on peanut butter. So if you watch this show, you've noticed that I'm, I've done peanut butter chicken, I've done oat, apple, peanut butter muffin. So today, I'm making another dish using peanut butter. So I am actually going to do peanut butter noodles. So what do we need? So the main ingredient, of course, for the sauce, we would need peanut butter. So here once again, if or most of you would know that now we have brought in Joby peanut butter. So what's the thing that I like about Joby is actually it's pure peanut butter with really 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 minimal amount of like those preservative and all. So at most they just include like salt and sugar. So the one I'm using right now is actually the chunky ones. Okay, so this is about 80 grams. And then we have a bit of sesame oil and spring onion. I'm using a whole bunch. But for the sauce, I'm only using the white part of it. The green part I'm using for like garnishing. And then we have a bit of date. I'm using about one tablespoon of date here. And then I have about one teaspoon of ginger, finely grated, and also a bit of lime. Then we're gonna mix them inside this bowl, the bowl of peanut butter, and then after it's really mixed, we're gonna put them on the stove just for a quick, quick minute. In goes the sesame oil and the crushed dates, the grated ginger, water, lime. Alright, it's all mixed. Then next, we'll bring this to the pan. But before that, so what noodles are we using today? Today, it's a bit special I'm using. Yes, it, it's fettuccine, but it's not your normal fettuccine. This, if you look at the colour, right, it's actually a bit more greenish, not your usual like yellow. So the greenish part is actually because of the spinach. I chose spinach fettuccine. So it has a bit more fibre compared to your normal fettuccine. So we'll see how it tastes. Then, we'll let this go on the stove, simmer for a few minutes. Not too long, we don't want to burn the peanut butter sauce. So until it starts to simmer, we'll turn off the heat and then straight away we add in the spaghetti. And there you have it, our peanut butter noodles using spinach fettuccine. Ta-da! Smells very nice, I'm gonna try it. I also added some chicken for extra protein. So if you don't want that, then, then that's uh, okay. And also up there, there's actually a few recipes we like using udon, uh, normal spaghetti. So if you would like to give this recipe a try, peanut butter noodles, and if you tried any other noodles, let me know in the comment section down below. And thank you for tuning in. Bye bye.